All right, here you go. We got outside taken care of. This is Lonesome George Eco Lodge. You've seen all this, but I just want to give you a little bit of a hostel tour before I leave. I need to go catch uh, the bus to back to the ferry across over to another bus over to the airport because I'm leaving the Galapagos today. We're heading for brighter pastures. We're heading towards the beach. First, I have to go to Guayaquil. Uh, the city again and then tomorrow head to the beach so, but i had to give you a tour of this place because it's freaking rad so the owner here victor has had this place for like uh, he's been here like 30 years something like that he started and started or started the whole project i guess when he was 18 years old and he built most of it if not all of it himself and it's all from just reusable material a bunch of stuff that he already found put together, built, see all the trees? It's just totally organic, all natural, really cool. So I had to show you, there's a lot to see. I need to kind of get going here a little bit, but I mean, it goes like a few stories up. There's a few other private rooms up top. They have their own little balconies and whatnot. It's painted real nice, little chill area. We'll go up there in a minute, but I'm just gonna do a quick little walkthrough now it is low season so during high season this place is kicking december to may it's pretty much high season my room is over here look at this cool like brick oven going on that's another room up top library we'll see my room in a minute but let's go up here it's pretty much like a big adult playground a big old adult tree house look at all this just all the natural wood painted everything pretty cool they have a whole bar kitchen set up pool table so Look at this big old shell, tortuga shell. I mean, it is rad and I'd really like to come back here during high season because, you know, the weather has been like this pretty much the whole time. So I really don't recommend it coming at this time. You really want to come December to May. It's brighter out, sunnier out, the water's warmer. The water is freezing. I went snorkeling yesterday, freezing. It also rains like a little bit or like there's like this weird misting every day just a little bit usually in the morning we got a little bit yesterday afternoon victor lives here okay let's go upstairs this is like another little chill out area upstairs i mean look at this place a little hangout area here maybe for yoga or bands this is cool i hung up hung out here the other day did some video editing Got the infamous hammocks, very beautiful. Nice and clean as well. They keep it really nice and tidy. Clean my room every day. Got some cigarettes. Very cool. Um, yeah, if it was nicer weather, I'd probably hang out here a little bit longer. Bamboo, but it's not, so I'm out of here. Um, but it was a cool little experience. Really enjoyed it here. Saw some animals I wanted to see. Missed a few, but there's always next time we'll go over here i think i think people are staying over here i'm not sure but I'll show you and then we'll go back down in these cool rooms see there's usually a pool during high season as well it's kicking man it's rocking oh what's that oh that goes up to like another little balcony another little top one little downstairs look at all this woodwork victor he's pretty much the man he's the owner with the plan all right, we can go see my room and then uh, get the heck on down the way. I need to go have some breakfast before I get going and get some change. Uh, it's a problem to get change anywhere around here. And I need it for the bus because the bus is only five bucks and I got like a 20. And I could do $5 for the bus, a dollar for the ferry and another five for the bus. All right, here's the room. Nice, couple beds. One for storage, one for sleeping, or love making if you're lucky. I was not. Um, little bathroom kicking, you know. I mean, like they got little glass bottles and all the walls and whatnot. Hey, what's up? So, pretty cool. Galapagos, I was number five, and it was uh, only $34 a night for this. And I basically had it all to myself. I mean, I had a couple over here and there's some guys from Amsterdam down the way. I think some people were next door, a girl next door, but hardly ever seen anyone. So it was like I had the whole place to myself. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Okay, 
That's about it. Quick and easy, like your mother. Okay, let's head down the road, get some breakfast, get on the road. Next destination. Peace.